This is Singapore Airlines legendary first class suites. He's always in first class, but in this iconic double suite, there is more than enough room for two of me. The Points Guy recently awarded Singapore Airlines best international first class. And now we're going to take you behind the scenes on why and how we think this is the best in the world. First up, <laughs> don't do that. Yeah. Let's pretend that didn't happen. And we're going to explore the approach that Singapore have taken in their lounges at Changi Airport, Singapore's home. Food should be exciting and we can do a lot more things. It's a bigger playground. And this mattress is just... Titan, you've lost me. We'll call you in an hour's time <laughs> when your flight's due. And we're going to learn how the incredible cabin crew create an atmosphere on board that is world class and that Singapore Airlines have become known for for decades. Welcome to Airplane Mode. Singapore Airlines has a long history of exceptional service in the air. The Sarong Kabaya was the look designed by Pierre Balmain for the Singapore girl back in 1968 and inspires the uniform today. For decades, they've been pushing the boundaries of what incredible air travel means. In fact, they were the first airline to introduce first class suites back in 2007. They've continued to innovate their cabins and lounges, relentlessly staying at the top of service. And today, their first class cabins have entire suites, some of which can be combined and made up into a double bed. We're gonna get an inside look on how Singapore Airlines makes this all happen. But first, we're on the ground in the world-renowned Changi Airport. This airport is stunning, with wonders such as a waterfall in the middle of the jewel, an actual butterfly garden, and a rooftop swimming pool. As part of a $37 million investment in its lounges, the Silver Chris First Lounge and the private room are the ones to visit and I'm going to take you inside. But before I do, remember to hit that subscribe button because we've got some amazing episodes of Airplane Mode coming. And now it's time to check this out. We're heading into the Silver Chris First Lounge now. We're not even in the best part yet and this is pretty amazing. This is absolutely wow. Sorry, just show me, show me some fried anything and I'm in. A wide selection of what looks like really both healthy but also indulgent foods. Massive selection of drinks. And what I've just noticed, a self-service wine bar. I think, you know, you get the ability to choose. Do you want to be served or do you want to serve yourself? Well, I want to serve myself. Let's go for a little glass of Sauvy B to kick everything off. Cheers. In addition to the buffet, there is also a made-to-order menu. I met with Philip to taste some of the most popular dishes. Philip, I'm excited to be here with you because I'm all about the food and drink. Is there a thread that's woven between what's served on the ground in the lounges and then in the sky? Most importantly is to complement each other. It's very restricted by what we have on aircraft. Being on ground, we can do a lot more things. It's a bigger playground. Yes, food should yes. be exciting and it should be it should be fun. Now we're talking about the satays. I know that Singapore is synonymous with the satay, but this wagyu beef that's like the most premium beef out there. So I would suggest to actually just have the satay yeah. by itself. It's very juicy, tender, flavorful. I love Ho Fun. It's something that I order when I'm at home in the UK, but I've never seen it like this before with, with this beautiful beef on yeah. top. I'm going to dive in, start with these delicious noodles underneath because this is what I love the most. Gooey, chewy, everything I love about this, but then the beef, you don't see beef like this really. This is absolutely fantastic. I'm glad you like it. After lunch, I met with Tim, the Vice President of Airport Operations, for a tour through the ultra-exclusive space of the private room. One of the things that as we walked through this passage, this passage was especially crafted so that it creates a break from the busyness of outside. This then adds on to this whole feeling of privacy and quietness. If you draw the parallel now with what's in our suite. It's also incredibly exclusive, so you have to be flying first class, yes. right? Thankfully, I get the chance to fly in the suite, so I get to come in here, which is, which is amazing. Maybe let's take a walk there. Let's have a look. One of the, the signature entrance items is, of course, this Lalit Dome. What we designed are these areas here, where you have your own table, your own seat, like your own little library. Do you know what I love as well? The 
movement and normalcy of the airport behind you, but you're protected. Noise, you can sink into this chair, and that craziness just exists in another place. Based on what we understand from passengers, there's a lot to be asked for. And one of the things that is very important is actually the showers. So all the showers come en suite. You have a built-in shower, rain shower, and the and we have a welcome feature as well. Toilets will welcome you as you come. This is, this is great, beautiful products everywhere, sparkling clean. This is the right time now to bring you to our restrooms with a bed, where after a good shower, you can take a short nap before you carry on your journey. Oh my God. I mean, this mattress is just insane. Bye Tim, you've lost me. Bye Nikki. Sorry. We'll call you in an hour's time when you <laughs> your flight's due. The only problem with these lounges is that you might never want to leave. However, something very special awaits these passengers. I'm excited to be able to take you on board with me on an actual Singapore Suites flight. Hello, hello, hello. Welcome to Singapore Airlines. Oh my God, it's so Let good to be here. Suite. Thank you. <laughs> Welcome aboard the stunning Singapore Airlines suites here on the A380. It is so impressive. Right here, tucked away, which we're going to see later, is a very comfortable bed that comes down from the side of the cabin here. With a touch of a button, swivels right round into your desired position for our geeks like me to be able to look straight out of the windows. You get banging off some noise cancelling headphones. The wonderful amenity kits provided by Lally. The suites come with some incredible storage. They even have this space designed especially for Birkin bags because they know their customers here on Singapore Airlines. Hi, Connie. So obviously, this is just the most incredible suite. What am I going to see today? <laughs> well, Singapore Airlines Suites and First Class is all about exclusivity, privacy, comfort, and personalized attention. I'm already feeling that. I already feel this like individual. This feels special already. Is there anything here that I can't see? What amenities am I going to get? Obviously, a very luxurious amenity kit. I think I saw the amenity kit. Ta da! Everything's so posh. I've got a room spray here. Is this to make my room smell nice? <laughs> That's actually really nice. Yes. Mr. Nikki? Tell me all the elements that make up this first class supper service. So first up, we've got... Always have to account for every service. Anti-clockwise, we have the bread plate. Butter, salt and pepper, glass and cutleries, and last but not least, the presentation plate. It looks like it's about to get complicated. <laughs> Signature caviar with warm bellinis. Here comes the champagne. I want to see if I've actually learned anything. And I want to try and serve you. Would you sit and allow me to serve you and see how I do? Of course. Miss Connie, are you ready for your supper? Yes. Okay, first up. <laughs> Don't do that. Yeah. Let's pretend that didn't happen. Don't worry about me, this is about you. And maybe we have to... I've already got it. <laughs> see, this is it. The crew have such an eye for these things. And I think with the small yes, plate correct. and then we're going to go butter or maybe salt and pepper ready for your meal. <laughs> Connie, how did I do? You're doing great at uh, the position, probably the salt and butter. Salt and pepper the wrong way around but everything else seems to be okay. Is this the first time a passenger has served you? <laughs> Finally, your champagne. But oh, please enjoy. So the best foods that we booked the cook, and that's what I've done today. I booked the cook allowed me to see all the different menu options and select this biryani. Crunchy. Dining in Singapore sweets is not just any run-of-the-mill meal. The wine pairing to go with a portion of soup. You're not just given a nice wine, you're given a wine that's specifically paired. We have the Chinese cocktail soup, 100% Pinot Noir. For the dessert, we have the lemon meringue tart with candied walnut. Meanwhile, Connie's back with more wine. See how many glasses we've got? Just gonna have a sip of the port and line my stomach. 
amazing, obviously. I've got into my Lalique pyjamas, got my Lalique facial mist, and probably what's one of the chicest bathrooms in the sky. It's big, there's vanity mirrors. You can sit down here and choose from a selection of amenities. Just gone to the bathroom to get changed, come back into what was before my dining room and what is now a bed ready for me to rest. And that is uh, <laughs> I just wanted to say thank you because you really made this unbelievably special for me. Time for me to go to bed. Have a good rest.